Hi, I'm Dan Hong and I'm here with my mother, Angie Hong, and we are about to cook an amazing egg recipe. And it's a take on something you used to eat while you were a kid and something I sort of grew up on as a quick breakfast. What we're doing is fried eggs with nook chum and fresh herbs, chili, ginger, and a bit of fried shallots. That is very, very yummy because nook jam is um, our favourite uh, dressing and dipping sauce. That's right. It is the universal so, Vietnamese dipping sauce yes. that's great with everything, but especially eggs. The role is to have the dry ingredients first and then the wet ingredient after. So first of all, the dry ingredient is sugar. All right, so sugar goes in. Sugar goes in. Yep. The same amount of water, hot water. Now stir it or whatever. Oh, chef. So you stir it until all the sugars <laughs> dissolve. Dissolve. And then the next thing is fish sauce. All right. Which fish sauce is indispensable. And then now, this is the vinegar. Yes. The yes. vinegar goes in. Yeah, vinegar goes in. Equal amount. Equal Again, amount. Again, equal amount. Yes. That's how easy it is. Have a little taste. Mmm. And I've, I've got some lime here that I'm just going to add for a little, bit yeah, extra, a little bit extra, a little bit extra acidity, mm -hmm. right? So I think the juice of one lime should be perfect and always keep it fresh. So what you can do, I think is this nook chum dressing stays in the fridge six, six months forever, Why? but Why? don't add anything to it. Just this don't is the base and yeah. then when you're going to use it, have it with your eggs. Then we add the lime juice, and then you can add ginger, you can add garlic, you can add chili, you can add any other. Any other, you know, um, herbs or anything you like, yep. Okay. All right, so the lime goes in, and then we're gonna add some chopped chili. I'm gonna put this in, right? And then a clove of garlic. Yes. Okay, all and right, then I've got so some ginger that yes. I've peeled. Mm -hmm. I'm not gonna use all of it, but just enough. Oh my god. Oh my god. The combination of lime, garlic, chili and ginger, it just... I mean, this sauce... Smells so nice. This it sauce goes so with aromatic. any protein, but with eggs, with egg it's egg next egg. level. Yes. It is next level, I'm telling you right now. Okay, so the nook chum's done. That can be set aside. And the next thing is the green onion relish. So, I'm cutting up the shallots. So one salt. Yeah. And two sugar. And then double the amount of sugar. sugar. Yep. Okay, and, and then the important thing is to mix it, right? Yes, to really, I to sort before of you add the oil yep. to sort of season it. Okay, I think the oil's yeah, pretty much there. Good. So you've got to be really careful, right? Stand back and then just slowly pour the oil over the shallots. And you can hear it sizzle and pop a little bit. That's why you gotta stand back and then just mix it up. And then the, the oil should, you know, lightly wilt the shallots. And also with the sugar and the salt in there beforehand, it keeps the color green. It doesn't go, doesn't change the color. That is beautiful. Nook chum done. All right. Now can you cook I'm that? ready. We're ready to cook the cook eggs, egg. mum. Yes, okay. All right, so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna actually break the eggs into a bowl because we're actually going to put quite a decent amount of oil in. And yes. if you try and uh, crack the eggs right into the wok, the oil might splash on your hand. So safety first, okay? So two eggs go in a bowl, like so. I'm just going to put the oil in now. Okay, so the most important thing here is we can't put the eggs in really early. You're not going to get that immediate sizzle that we want right, when we're frying an egg. When it, it's bubbling around the chopstick, that's when it's getting hot. Okay, yeah, starting okay. the bubble. Yes, yeah, starting the bubble. Never too late to learn some new tricks, okay? <laughs> what if it was a plastic chopstick? No. <laughs> Oil's smoking now. Really gently add your eggs. And you can see straight away 
nice and bubbly. And look, you're just letting it fry like so. All right, and they're, they're pretty much done. These eggs are almost done. You can see that nice brown underside. I remember you used to cry right. when I um, the, the egg yolk is broken, when I prop it in, so I have to do it. I don't recall that, actually. <laughs> Look at that. Oh my gosh. And you can see, you can see these nice, yeah, look at that. Look at the underside. You can see nice, frilly, golden whites. The yolk is still quite soft and runny. All right, so let's dress it. Let's dress it now. All right, okay, so put the shallot relish on first. Just all over, like, like that. Yeah, but don't cover the egg yolk. Oh, sorry. Yep. My mum knows presentation important. All right. Now, mum, do you want to spoon some of the nook chum yeah. uh, over the oh, egg? Yes, I will. I will. Oh my god, this is. Oh, yum. Spoon a little bit of dressing on this salad, just a oh, touch, okay. just to dress it, dress the leaves. Oh. I didn't know that either. It's a bit of a chef thing. So I'm just going to garnish it with a little bit of fried shallots. And a wedge of lime? Yeah, a wed little wedge of lime, I reckon. Yeah. So. That's a cheek. Yeah. Cheek. And there you go. This is our fried eggs with nook chum dressing, shallot relish, chili, lime, and fresh herbs. All right, yeah, let's, let's go, go for, for it. it. Yeah. OK, this is my extra chili. Oh, so look at that yolk. Go. See, that's what I mean. You get the yolk, you smear it. Yeah. Don't go to my egg, okay? Right. Uh, you got your own egg. I'm going to try and get the perfect bite. That's it. Okay. All right. Slow Ready? Time. Your is not as pretty as mine. Look at it. Cheers, mum. Okay. Okay. Cheers. Mmm. Mmm. The richness of the yolk. The texture of that fried egg, plus the crunch of the shallots, and then you just get that sort of the heat of the herbs, the acidity of the nook chum, the garlic, the ginger, the chili. It's what you want in an egg dish. Don't you reckon? Oh my god. For more inspiration on how to make your own meal to remember with your loved ones, go to australianeggs.org.au slash meal to remember.